Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls and whatever else is watching, my name is Nick and we are playing once more Dragon Quest Builders on the Nintendo Switch. And as you probably have noticed, my base has become, well, rather different. I made a wall, a proper wall, not the dirt that I had before, that would just keep out the ghosts. No, this one also keeps out pretty much every enemy except for the boss. However, that about that a little bit later when I, we are actually in the boss fight. Uh, the material that I use is just chalk um, and that can be found pretty much atop of those mountains. The tops of those mountains are nothing more but chalk. So you can uh, mine it from there. For the rest, I've been killing Drachimats, you know, those red Drachies, for lime grass seeds. Because I wanted to make, well, this kind of uh, grass here. It's a little bit different than the grass seeds that the Drachies uh, used. It's a different color. Um, for the rest, what are we going to do today? Well, I am going to explore the area of the ancient palace properly now. And do Gerontius a side quest. He's been waiting quite a long time already. Really? Really? Okay. Yes, I've plotted down quite a while ago. Pretty much the game thinks that you pick up every quest as they pop up. Um, and then go through the teleportal doing them as you explore. So you have multiple quests active at the same time. However, that's not really my style. I like to be orderly and fashionable and do the quests one at a time and pro preferably finish them if I, if I can. Oh 
Really? We've met Talamus, at least his puzzles, already before. We've solved two of them. Really? The Farmer Sutra? Oh la la, isn't that a uh, reference to something? Oh, farming! You know, in the previous chapter, Magnus had something to talk uh, to us about farming, growing seeds from, well, growing crops from tiny seeds. Yeah, sure, but they don't have to expect a, um, a restaurant uh, dinner here as well. Just stuff them with uh, frog stools and butter beans, okay? Well, and some bread. Okay, yeah. Um, Mildred has added a new recipe that we need to have. Oh, a super salad. We don't know the recipe just yet. And fry put potato fries, we cannot make either. Oh yeah, this is a... Uh, for the future. What I did notice though, they have been cooking some exquisite or at least bigger, um, how do we say it? Some bigger uh, recipes. I don't know where they get the potatoes for the potato salad. Because I have never found any, or the fish for a, for a bouillabaisse. Can I even make a bouillabaisse? No, I cannot. And the potato salad also. That is something I cannot make. They have been cooking things that I cannot even cook at this moment. Or ha haven't even unlocked yet. That's so awesome, then I don't have to do it. And well, I'll go over those recipes later. Sorry, I forgot something because I also want to explore that area and it's a good idea to bring at least one uh, bonfire with you if you go there. Why? You, well, you will see later. I'll see you at the halfway house. Okay, I also took a nap at the halfway house because it was getting a little bit late. And the quest marker for uh, Grontius' quest is targeted in that direction. And you are going to die. Really? Eh, it's a, uh, well, not that much of a drop. Let's see, what is, ooh, I can see a chest up there, but that's not what I was trying to find, figure out. Ooh, I have 160 different items obtained. What the heck is here? But, ooh, there are some stuff here. If I use this on, no. Can I use, oh. Let's pick up those flowers, shall we? I have now a full, oh. You... Whew. That was scary. But let's climb up here. Yes, you I will fight later. 
This chest will give us a seed of life. And, ooh, here yeah, there is a lot more to grab. Again. Ow. Ooh, that guy does damage. I need... Well, the rusty nuggets I do need. Uh, for the rest, is there something that I haven't ha found before? Or never got? Well, broken brickwork. I think I've got those things. The lapidated crates. I think I already had those as well. Uh, it's a good thing. Oh, those barricades. I haven't had one. Ouch. Ow. They do do a lot of damage. So let's start off by actually going in the direction of the quest marker before I explore too far. Hey, stand still. I was thinking, can I shovel up? Yeah, I can. Fibbert's Fern. Um, yeah, the good. Ooh, we also see a couple of Botkin houses over here. That will also be interesting. And that's also why you had to bring the... Ow! Okay, as they take the time to get up, the, it's always a good... Those white flowers, it looks as if they are milk blossoms. But, to the contrary, they are potatoes. And now I know how to make a potato salad. And I know how to make a super salad. Which is actually really good. If I were to use a shovel to dig them up, the result is the same as as a uh, as the axe because it will just give me the potato or the sword. It will also just give me the potato. Okay, this is where our quest marker leads to. Ow! Did not have to. Was there something on top of that? No, there isn't, but... No, there was nothing on top of that ar archway. You are going to chase me, aren't you? Please stay away. Because this is where the quest that Gorontius gave me leads to. I have to defeat that... Ow! Skeleton, get over here. Okay, now is your tu turn. Seriously? Ow! The hitboxes for this... How? Those hitboxes are really awkward. But, as you can see, defeating the lunatic drops a seed of life. And inside, we find... Actually, a faded piece of paper. It's already been generations. Interesting. If it has been generations since uh, Talamus 
could no longer create, then how did he create his puzzles? That's interesting, but that was the Pharma Sutra, and now I learned how to make a rig. This is a useful tool, just like the fishing rod. And I know how to generate and create weed seeds. Butter bean sprouts. Potato sprouts. Hard fruit seeds. Was that all? Okay, yeah. Um, here we have once more locks that need keys. And as you can see, there are chests inside. We will have to come back later at this place. Um, for the rest, I will rob those of... Uh, there have to be... Well, there are some... Ooh, Ruby! I think there was... Oh, yeah. We have some additional chests. This is a... Some chimera wings. And, of course, medical herbs. We are going to need a lot of those as well. Okay, um, I'm gonna go back to the halfway house to sleep up for a little bit. I had some rest here again and you are still not giving me a sapphire. Ow. Okay, it's time that we uh, went and explore around here for a little bit. Especially those... Well... Those Botkin houses. Um, if you're asking, is there something in, in this place? And these things? No, you won't find any treasure in there. They are just for the bricks and for the... Ooh. For the bricks and for the dirt. For the rest, they aren't actually worth much. Ooh, hey little buttkin. Anything wrong? I don't know. Okay. Well, I mix up a little bit. Sometimes I eat the food I like first, sometimes I eat the food I don't like first. And that has to do much more with do I want to keep it warm or not? Do you want to eat it warm or not? With cold food I eat it last, with warm food I eat it first. That's why I eat those things first then. Then you will have to keep it warm or something. Yes, there is. You have to keep it warm. And this is why I told you to bring a bonfire. Because it creates the oven that he wishes for. You're welcome. No, we're not. Although some others may be. He studied beneath a chef in Damdara. We actually encountered a chef in Damdara. In the desert over there. We actually learned how to make the brick barbecue from him. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, what did we get? 10 pots of butter beans. 10 potatoes. Yeah, eating a good meal uh, does can give some happiness, yes. And that's also my problem why I'm overweight. gonna go fishing later because salmon red snapper and tuna I am going to need that also fishing for those things can open up uh, open up new uh, recipes hello oh I had a problem with my head uh, music My headphones uh, didn't uh, stop for a little bit. You have a meat feast! Where did you get the meat? Also, something else. I see something else. I just... I'm not gonna steal it. I just want to... Let's make room first. I wanted this! A chimney! Oh, he has actually more chimneys underneath. But... Weird? I cannot do that? Then how did it come up here in the first place? Okay, well, now I have a chimney. Game, don't do this to me. Um, let's see, there was another, also something about this area here. Ouch, I did not have my sword equipped. Something about this area. E, as if I need a pile of bones. In the original Dragon Quest 1. This area did not have all this brick over here. It was actually a luscious green field. However, well, however, uh, in between Dragon Quest 1 and this game, there is probably, an, an, well, the castle back there that we came from, where we had Kama, uh, Farmer Sutra. Has had been built. Ooh, hey, hello. Oh. A potato sprout well I did not bring one with me no sorry but I do co will come back later yeah uh, what I was talking about this was just a green field there were no um, I do have to have potato though there were what well, was no construction however To have a these buildings over here is not such a weird thing because this area where we are ow uh, 
Okay, I am pro apparently not allowed to explain things here. Where is the world map? I need the world map. Where did that thing go? Oh, oh it's over there. Sorry. Looking at the world map, where we are at this moment, we are actually a little bit to the north. The north part of this has been created into a giant fortress. That's what all those bricks are from. That's because at the entire west side, that left uh, outermost point of the landmass area, when the hero went to the dragon lord himself, he created there a rainbow bridge. That was where the Dragon Lord's castle on the island west here from this area to and connecting to this part. Yeah, that's where the Dragon Lord could just walk over the land over a bridge to the landmass, to the mainlands. And that's why it probably is the first place we, uh, people of Elfgard would use to defend themselves against the Dragon Lord. They would build a base here, they would build a castle, a fortress in order to protect themselves. Little good did it do to them though, because they were overwhelmed by these teleporting dudes. Uh, okay. Ooh, what do we have here? A skeleton and a flowers around it. With a machine that looks decrepit. It's a broken down. Hmm. I am, I just got myself a new blueprint, a tribute to a missing maker. This, how, why not? Would you mind, I am trying to figure out what blueprint this is. That's for you. This is a graveyard blueprint. That's really something. Yes. It does pull the heartstrings a little bit. He wanted to make a graveyard apparently here. And considering the bones are here, you, you are expected to put a memorial in this place. On this spot. This is something, yeah, this, this is really touching, I have to say. Um, we have some more caves around here, I think, but nothing that actually will give us something new. And I want to go there, but it's getting a bit later. I'll see you back later here. I'll return to this place. Okay, I actually... I changed my mind on uh, going there. Uh, we will go, go there to that point later. But for now, Gerontius, uh, I'm going to hand in a quest to you. Yes, I have the phone to Pharma Sutra. Yes. You can read it. Well, he is smarter than Rolo does. Can you teach us? I'm impressed. Okay, I'm even more impressed.
that I know. Ah. So that's something we cannot really hope for our save for salvation again, eh? But do I have to rebuild that shrine as well? Well, maybe. After I'm done with Remoldar, I can take a look there. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, well then, uh, if a tree is already there, then uh, there probably is no more room for a shrine to begin with. The World Tree, Yggdrasil. Interesting. I'll talk about a bit more about that later. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's take a look at the time. Well, I do want to make a room and uh, it's not the blueprint though. Uh, let's see where I were. I need, let's hang you up here. Um, it's something that I actually should have done a lot earlier. I should have made this way earlier. Um, let's put away the things that I don't need. Well, you are for later? Not yet. Much later. That's not gonna be this episode or well, maybe the next. I don't, but I don't think so. Um, I do need a leather sack, yes, and I need, where is it, I need a shop sign, you know what, let's make two, I talked about having outside decorations as well, so, um, if I would hang up a ladder sack, uh, let's hang it here, and put down a shop sign, oh, right, 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 um, that's why I brought this along. I need you, because a regular bonfire will not be sufficient. I need to have a wall mounted fancy light. And that will make a carpenter's studio. And with this carpenter, well, residents will build more furniture and more elaborate furniture. And it also makes my equipment more durable, because Heck, I've been going through uh, that sword and uh, the axe lately. That went fast. Those iron weapons are strong, but they also break fast. Actually, what have they been making me? Uh, still only this. Yeah, a little bit disappointing. Yay, they like it. Also, I think I can now make... Yeah, I can make a super salad and french fries. Let's do that. French fries requires potatoes. Quite a lot of them, actually. But you do get three french fries. And a super salad is... No! Okay, just a moment. Okay, I've got the weed that I needed. 
So let's build that super salad. Damn, it does take a lot. Potatoes, butter beans, wheat, hard fruit. Cooked crab claw. Actually, cooked crab claw is a... Well, a prepared dish that now is a part of this dish. Okay. Can I make the sailors too? No, I need the rest of the... I need some more. And I need to f go fish first. Okay. Let's see. Oh, you wanted a french fries. You're only halfway done? Do you have six? Because I already gave you three things, didn't I? Oh well. Ah, you're done. At least I hope you're done and not like these three. But you don't have that ominous aura. Let's go to bed first. Okay. Yay! You are done! Although hidden by... <laughs> completely hidden by the... Uh, the text balloons. Mildred. Uh, probably were the tree ends because after you came here you ate and you actually got something so it's not that bad yeah pretty much That's the plan! Seven. Okay, we know what we need to do next episode. We need to go fishing. I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Leave a like behind if you did. Leave a dislike behind if you didn't. But I would also like to have some feedback about what did and what I did wrong or did uh, right, so I can improve my videos in the future. Thank you for standing in view, Notch. Of course, I can count on you to bomb the uh, picture. At least, thank you for watching. Until next time. Bye!